David, if you love me, you will let me go. Cassandra, please, just give it back. Give it back! Isn't it hard to have a bucket list when can't ever die? Not really, because people die and places die and it becomes more about doing and seeing things with people before it's too late. <laughs> you don't love me. When he's dead, you get 30%. We agreed to 50 the other night. I said 50 if you were good. I only got 30%. I could turn you into the police. <laughs> right. A lawyer colluding with me and my husband's death for 30% of his will. <laughs> uh, when did the movers say they're coming in? Um, I think they said Monday. Monday? Yeah. Sweet. Three days from now. <laughs> we'll just pretend like we're camping. We'll build a fort and make some noise. No, you're... you're absolutely right. My only friend is a goldfish named Duck. Audra, I took it too far. This isn't me talking. That's... that's all the shots, shots from the bar. Where are you going? I don't know. I'm leaving because obviously you don't want me here and you're not my friend. It's midnight. What are you going to do? You know what? I don't know. I'll figure it out. We always ended the moment before it went too far. Just long enough. Because we both knew. If we lingered past the moment. I just can't stop seeing that look that he gave me. Look, that was a totally different situation. I know. I'll be fine. Yeah, I'm good. You sure? Yeah. Okay. No! Don't! Don't! Please! No! Let me go! Please! No, no! No! Don't be such a t-